Hey guys, welcome to today's video and today is going to be my August Glossy Box unboxing. Um, this month was a special month because I think it was their, I can't remember if it was their three year or their five year sort of birthday. Um, so all of their subscribers got sent an email to select an MUA palette. I've already got the undressed MUA palette and I really really love this. Um, as you can see, I have loved it a little bit to death as I have hit pan on quite a few of them. When they said they were going to send an MUA palette out of my choice, I was quite happy to be honest. So they made you choose one of like the palettes that they offered. I think it was like, I can't remember if it was three or four different palettes. I think it was four of them actually. I think it was four different palettes that they made you choose from and um, yeah, you just chose one and then one would come in your box. So I'm waiting to see it. This month's box is really quite different. It's got like this GB, obviously for Glossy Box, um, and it's this beautiful grey and pink design. It says Glossy Box here, which it normally doesn't, and it has Ray Feather, which I'm guessing is the designer of the box. So without further ado, let's jump straight in. So this is the card for this month. It says, Dear Glossies, we are five years old this month, so I was five years old, and we are kicking off our birthday celebrations with a collector's edition for our fifth birthday design in collaboration with the Moment Lux Accessory label Ray Feather. So basically because it's their fifth birthday um, they've decided to do this funky little design um, I suppose just to say happy birthday to them. I really love all the details inside like I don't know if you can see that but like there's all the grey inside and grey ribbon and grey sticker. I just like that little touch. So the first thing I see is this great big thing here and this is the the Deep Pore Cleansing Facial Brush and Massager by Spa To You. And this basically just looks like a deep pore cleanser sort of brush that you just sort of lather up your face with all your facial cleaner and then brush your face. It says directions to use. Apply cleanser to dampen skin, use wet brush to massage in circular motions, continue until skin is cleansed, wash the brush and leave to dry. So basically I'm just gathering that this is sort of just gets into the pores and just washes your face. I like that it comes with this like little guard right here so that, oh my god I just hit this off. I thought it would just be a plain brush but actually it's got like these funky green things all inside. So on the card this is obviously full size um, and this is $6.99. This is a deep pore facial cleansing brush. Um, so all of the soft bristles like around here um, and not the green ones are all to sort of massage away the dead skin and the green ones here like the silicone green little things in there are to sort of apparently massage your skin and improve circulation um, I suppose for new growth of cells. As a side note can we just talk about this lip colour I've currently got on I mean it is this is Soap and Glory's Sexy Motherpucker Matte Lip in Firecracker and I am currently obsessed with it, like that is gorgeous. I love it. The next thing in the box that I see is the MUA palette. Now this isn't actually the one I've chosen and I did check my emails as I was looking at this and they've sent me an email saying that they've basically messed up and they've sent me the wrong palette and in next month box they're going to send me the palette I wanted which is really cool of them actually because they don't have to do that at all um, they could have just given me this one and be like sorry so yeah I'm really quite impressed actually with Glossy Box that they're doing that like they're sending out the one I wanted and chose on the cl like, click box and I've got this one as well so so this is the MUA palette in Glitter Ball um, this is a retail price of £4 I believe yeah £4 um, and I really love these bottom row of colours like all along here like Hustle I already have as um, a big single eyeshadow and I love it so I'm quite excited to play around with this the next thing in the box is this and this is the Cow Shed Wild Cow Invigorating Body Lotion this says that it has essential oils of lemongrass, ginger and rosemary so it's all made with natural ingredients which I actually really appreciate because it's good to know that it's not all chemicals and also it's just basically a lotion that's giving your face an energy buzz. That's what the card says. This is a sample but the full size is normally £20 so I'm gathering it's quite a nice lotion because £20 lotion is not cheap. So yeah I'm really um, looking forward to trying this little buddy out and it comes in really cute packaging. I just think that's really cute. The next thing in the box is this little blue tube and it says Mud Masky. 
Mudmaski, Mudmaski. Facial detox and purifying recovery mask, a pH balanced, pore refining, hydrating, anti-aging, brightening and smoothing. This is a sample, but the real size is 53 pounds. God damn, girl. So I'm gathering like this is a little tube of a mask and on the back it says not tested on animals, paraffin free and natural ingredients. Again, really cool. I mean, we've already got the natural ingredients of the body lotion. I'm seeing a bit of a recurring theme here with sort of like skincare. I'm down with it. I'm loving it. I haven't actually smelt any of these, just realised. Ooh. Oh, it smells nice. I'm not sure about it. it's 53 pounds worth of nice, but it smells good. I don't want to use too much, but I squirted a tinsy wincy bit out and it's kind of just grey. You can see that. Yeah, it just feels. Well, oh, actually, it's really thick. I didn't think it'd be that thick. It's a really thick clay mask, so actually, I'm quite interested to see how that that works on the face. Is it just me that just really enjoys pulling out, like, I'm pulling out masks and just washing my face and just being like, ah. Oh. This, um, this cow shed one, which I forgot to sniff, because that is a vital part of this whole box. You've got to sniff everything. Okay, the first thing I'm going to say is this just... It smells like gingerbread men. It's very, very strong. Gingerbread men? Gingerbread man. Men. It just smells really strong, but actually that smells so yummy. Like, I love ginger and I love lemon, and this just smells like home baking and Christmas. The last thing in the box is this interesting little pouch. I don't know what this like material is called, it's like, um, oh my god, what is this material called? I'm guessing it's for like all the makeup and stuff that they're giving you. Fit it all in, in here. It says GB, so it's the monogram for glossy box. But actually, do you know what, at first I thought I was, I was being really stupid, because it's like the Olympics, I thought it was like GB for Great Britain. Am I the only one that thought that? No, maybe, maybe I am. Inside it's got like this plasticky stuff and I'm sure that's probably to stop makeup from staining that, which I actually really like. Um, and not a lot of makeup bags do that and it really gets to me. Like they have just the cloth interior but then your makeup like explodes inside of it and it just goes everywhere. But yeah, I really like it, it's really cute. It comes with a nice solid zip, which I do appreciate. Um, really cute. It's pink, it's white. It's quite flat as well. It's all right. It's cool. They are retailing this for £20. If you were to pay £20 for this, I'd call you a fool. Obviously the box and this bag all kind of go together and it's all sort of like the monogram idea and it's all been designed by this really feather woman. Congratulations, it looks beautiful. So if the samples in this box were to be full size, then the whole box in its entirety would come to £104, which is pretty insane when you're paying £5 for it in the first place. Um, but yeah, wait, is that it? Have I got everything? Oh, nice. So yeah, that's really cool. It's a good box, it's got a lot of skincare in it this month, and the fact that they're sending me the other eyeshadow palette because they kind of messed it up a little bit. I mean, I'm quite happy with this, to be honest. It's got a nice palette. So I was just checking the card once over to check I hadn't missed anything, and at the very top, which I completely like skimmed over, it says that in September's box they're having the um, Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara Sample. Um, I'm not sure if it's the waterproof or just the normal one. It doesn't really specify, but there's just like a little picture there about it. So yeah, if that's not worth signing up for, I don't know what is. It's an amazing mascara. To be honest, overall, this month's box, as I think, has been pretty good, and I love 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 this box i'm gonna keep it on display i think no put some things in it who knows if you're thinking about subscribing to glossy box i would definitely recommend it is like having a birthday present every month and that to me is freaking awful so i hope you've enjoyed this video please give a massive thumbs up if you did and i will see you in my next video my lovely orange lipstick it's so orange Okay, so this month's box is really quite different. It's oh. gingerbread man, men, 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 gingerbread men.